Coach Joe Golden say that they just got their full-time strength and conditioning coach last year or this year? <laughs> that are just a couple of years. Coming, so. And here they are. Yes. From the plains of West Texas. He says he gets it all the time, though. For now, then the rest of the game, he'll be known as the other Reggie Miller. Right. Of course, he went to UCLA as well. That's a good hit. Reggie Miller at the controls. Tiger Campbell on him. Here is Daniels at 5'7", the point guard. What a great mm. game he had. What a lead for the seven-footer. Well, you talked about the 5'7", spark plug. Damian Daniels inside. Bruins came into this tournament having dropped four in a row. As Riley with the left hand scores it and a foul and one opportunity. They're really able to capitalize off of it. We'll see. Left-handed finish. Nicely done. Corian Mason. He's got some skills, though. Give it up a little bit of height. Way better athlete than Charles. Way. <laughs> Tiger Campbell, a little pull-up. Nicely done. Hey, you know, that's a big bass. Campbell with seven points against BYU. Michigan State and BYU, the first two opponents for UCLA. That is smooth as it gets. Jules Bernard, he gives a lot of credit to Brett Tanner as well, his defensive coach. Shot clock gets low, coming out of this timeout, and a hang and a finish by Reggie Miller. Nicely done. That move right there, that's the kind of shot that Mick Cronin wants to see. He wants to see these step-ins, quick decisions. Because of the way Abilene Christian closes out, three-pointer is true. Riley gets stuck, looking for help. Campbell, he'll pull it, long two, tough shot, cash, money for Tiger Campbell. Back-to-back -back turnovers, however, and now UCLA can tie or take the lead here. Jaquez, strong inside, put an entry into the scorebook, they've all scored, Campbell has four points, and now Kaiman, got it. Got one of the purest strokes going. Bruins. In the lead, Juzang, no, Riley gets the board, and Riley scores it, and one. The way you would have thought ACU would even be close in the game, but because they forced so many turnovers and got 27 more shots. Speaking about shots, came and talked about that beautiful stroke. The Division I level, Steve Shields, his mentor at Arkansas Little Rock. There's a three-pointer down for Kaiman. Interior defense by the Bruins. Nice spin, Clark able to score. That's a 16-0 UCLA run. And Singleton, shooter to shooter. Yeah, look at that rebound, a standing rebound there by Clark. Goes up strong and finishes. <laughs> well, they're getting some mismatches inside. Get the ball through the nets because then it allows you to set up your full court press right, right there. Right there, good call, Jim. Yeah. And a call right into the mix. That snaps 11 consecutive misses for Abilene Christian. Reggie Miller gives it up. Good hands by Juzang. Miller, tough shot. Bounce. Got it. Here's Reggie Miller. ACU needing a conversion here. And the lefty, Daniels, knocks down a big three. Has been shut out the last five and a half minutes. Well, not the same kind of shots when they were getting to the middle of the court as we saw when they built that big lead. Juzang steps into one. Catch and shoot for Johnny Juzang. And Jaquez. Got a mismatch here if he wants it. Got Reggie Miller on him. This is a no contest right here. And Hawkins scores easily. Now the Wildcats can just get it and go. Jules Bernard, patient, gives it. Riley, easy. Singleton kicks it. Hawkins always makes a smart pass. Extra pass. Cash. Johnny Juzang for three. And they look like... A free-flowing offense here. Singleton. Oh, they get a second chance. Singleton with a three-pointer timeout on the floor. He took down number six, BYU. Juzang scored 27 in that game. Going up top. Riley on the receiving end from Singleton. UCLA by 21. Five minutes into this second half. Had a 10-point lead at the half. And Johnny Juzang keeps it rolling. Transferred his first year at UCLA, impact player for the Bruins. They see you running out of options here. That's a good hit. They needed that. Makai Morris with a three pointer. Everything seemed rushed for Texas. 
complete opposite here with UCLA in regards to their patience, like that right there. Just so simple. Abilene Christian coming out of the Southland Conference. We move into the WAC next year. Yeah, nice finish inside by Tobias Cameron to operate this program. Logan McLaughlin misses a three. Good recovery on the other end. Got him a second chance. Four turnovers in 40 minutes. Protected the ball well. This is a team at ACU that forces a lot of turnovers. Getting some offense from Makai Morris here. Riley looking for shooters. Campbell, that extra pass. There you go, Jim. Right on cue. And Tiger Campbell steps into a long two. Full display right now by UCLA. Another finish by Makai Morris. The match would be good for him in that situation, but no chance. No. Shot clock down to two. Juzang comes up short. Haquez the follow. Joe Golding looking for answers. UCLA has been able to spread the scoring around. Again, here's Makai Morris. I'm going to go ahead and let him ride at this point. That's a long two. Taking advantage of the opportunity to be on the court and play. Bernard for three. Man. I mean, he's taking what he's done in Buffalo and added size and athleticism, more talent, and got those players to play in a very similar fashion. And it's paid off for. It's always a team that kind of bursts onto the national spotlight at this tournament. And Oral Roberts and ACU have been those teams this year. Nice finish inside for Riley. They got a mask for him. Went down to Bloomington to get a, to get a mask. And he wore it for about 30 seconds, I think, and then threw it out in round one. Juzang, three-pointer for Juzang. UCLA, we were talking about kind of the urban flight of Midwest people going to UCLA and really helping out the program. And you come back with that stat about that's Indianapolis has not been good to him. Yeah, but I, that's my Mick Cronin piece is how I score. What I like to do, just like Mick Cronin, you got to know when to build up and when to tear down. I thought maybe that was a good time for that. <laughs> <laughs> that's cold and cold. That's cold, bloody man. Straight years. Well, I mean, yep, there were some big names, too. Yeah, Mark Few, Roy Williams, Tom Enzo, Bill Self. Great respect between those two, Mick Cronin. And Joe Golding.